Hey guys, um, sadly my first video, uh, for some reason my cell phone thought it had a microphone in there uh, when it did not, so it did not actually record my audio, uh, which means you, you have to miss out on my uh, original uh, reaction of disappointment as I received my Anovos helmet today. Um, so I am really not pleased with it. It's very hard to make out, but all across sort of the surface of the dome um, are these, I don't know, it, it looks like fingerprint smudges uh, that are actually thoroughly embedded in the clear coat. It's really hard to capture on the camera. You can kind of see them now. Um, and they do not, actually there you can see it. It almost looks like a hand grabbing it, right? Um, there's a lot of them everywhere and they do not wipe off not even with uh, polish or glass cleaner sorry let me just put it back down um, all that stays on the other thing that i'm not happy with is the overall actually there's a nick there looks great that definitely is a nick um overall the color is also way too dark um Granted, we're inside right now. Let's actually go into some different lighting setups so you can kind of see it change in real time. A lot of these videos don't do that. Let's move over to where there's much more sunlight. And it's still very dark. Uh, I took it outside earlier when the sun was actually brightly shining and it still looks way more um, gunmetal than, than anything else. Uh, the other thing I'm not happy with is the weathering. Let's see if the camera can pick this up. Let's go to a little bit of a more more beneficial camera angle there, but it, it's not as thick as I've seen on some of the helmets. Uh, it's definitely a little bit excessive in terms of how wide it is. It doesn't look like a like a naturally accrued weathering that you would expect to see in a recess like this. Um, but what I have big issues with it, it almost looks like it's just painted on really sloppily uh, with a brush. It's hard to describe, um, but that's really what it looks like to me. Um, so yeah, for the price, uh, I, I'm definitely not happy. Uh, I've reached out to Novos about the whole fingerprint situation. Um, I doubt they'll be able to do much unless I'm willing to send this back and uh, then wait maybe again months before I see something else. Uh, so maybe they'll at least give me a partial refund so I can get this repainted. Because uh, I do like the shape of it. I think the shape is nice. The fit is nice when I wore it earlier. Uh, but again, in, in terms of finish for what it is and what they're asking, I, I honestly think it's really quite terrible. Um, and yeah, definitely not. Look at that. Like, what even is this weathering? Looks like mustard stains, like a guy with greasy mustard fingers handled this helmet rather than, you know, naturally uh, accrued, um, soot or, or, or dirt. Uh, it does not at all look nice. So anyways, um, I was hoping to be excited by this. And I am not, um, but I figured I'd at least share my honest opinions with you. So there you go.